what's good, what to do, so yeah guys, the guy that's standing on the left hand side end up taking his friends, end up being a group of African Americans into a restaurant in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. The restaurant is called Nicks and Sticks. And the owner says something to the family and called them the N-word. This is unacceptable. Check this video out. You ready? And then they come. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Then you come out here. Call the police. Please, we need a report. Please, call it. Oh, we need a report. Hey, you messed up, man. No, I didn't mess up. Because no. this is their first time experience and they're friends of mine here. That was and then not, you want to make me feel bad that was because not, I sat down at the table. That was and then not. you asked me, you asked me if I'm going to consult with these N-I-G-G-E-R-S. No, no. Yeah, that's oh, exactly what you said. You, Every one of them heard it. No, they did not. Yes, they did. They, was all yes, the they did. And then when I got pissed off and you knew I was pissed, you went to hide behind the bushes. No. And I walked right around there and couldn't find you. That's not right. I'm this right is here. their first time here, Jay. Right that was. I was just bragging. Ask everyone. I was bragging how good it was to come here, and they wanted to come back until you showed your ass out here and had a problem with race. The day of my son's 22nd birthday, he had the encounter. Then, really? That's not right. You, you should be ashamed of yourself, man. No. So you know what? We're not going to have anything else to say. We're not causing problems. I'm making my point to you. These are my friends. I've known him a long time. Our first time down and here, and he called all this a nigga. And when I come out, you confront me for talking to him. You say, so you condone this? That's what you asked me. You condone, you condone the blacks? I no condone about it. They're my friends. They're just like us. You just didn't want them in there. And I'm not for that. And you know what? As far as I'm concerned, everybody that eats in here that I know will probably never be back. Oh, this is going live. I'm posting all of this. Thank you, Mr. I apologize. I apologize, y'all's first night. You can't this stupid, sir. You can't. Well, just tell me what was said when you walked out. When I walked out, he jumped all over me and said, so you condone sitting at the table with the N-I-G-G-E-R-S? Yeah, thank you. Okay, we're about to check out some of these comments out. You ready? Let go. Now, that's a true friend. Bravo. Also, to the mom who was there for her son's birthday, I hope your son had an amazing birthday despite this encounter. From Alabama here, I'm in Michigan now. This is one reason why. I have a lot of respect for the big man sticking up for his friend. Thank you, sir. Not hiding behind the bushes. That man wasn't having it. Much respect. This is how the fix start. Hats off to you, sir, for speaking up. And also, shout out to the dude on the left-hand side for sticking up for his friends. And also putting the dude on the right in check. I also feel sorry for the 22-year-old who had to experience that on his birthday. That was not right at all. Also, to that restaurant owner, I hope your restaurant gets shut down too. Point blank, period. So, what do you guys think about this video in this situation? Let your boy know at the bottom of the video. Hit the like button, comment below, share the video, follow your boy, follow your boy, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Stay tuned and catch you guys on my next video.